Hi, in this video I would like to explain to you the design concept of the Fly PNP pick and place machine. Here the idea is to maximize the space available for the pick and place area and therefore I put the guide rails for the y-axis at a certain height outside on the left and right hand side uh, so that the feeders can pass through underneath and the two guide rails are supporting the x-axis uh, where the z-axis is then can fly over uh, the whole uh, x and y pick and place area the y-axis is driven by two motors at the back as you can see there which are static and so they're not uh, adding up to the uh, the moving axis basically and the x-axis is driven by one motors right there on the left and all the uh, cable chains are put on the right hand side outside the pick and place area and so the uh, z-axis here as you can see which is just a small uh, kite rails particularly uh, driven by one mot uh, stepper motor just for the vertical for going up because it goes down by uh, gravitation as you can see and so if it should hit the ground it will not break the needle because it can freely move up uh, and down uh, along the uh, the x-axis guide rail and you can see also there is a small camera on the right hand side of the um, pickup needle and so with this design as you can see uh, you can put up to 28 8 millimeters tapes on the left and right hand side and uh, the rolls are located on the outside you have one space for the JTAC tray uh, behind and plenty of space for the PCBs and probably more of possibilities for other feeders in the front okay so that's it for the design i hope you like it and thank you for watching